Now, plans to deal with Pittsburgh's growing deer population. They're eating through the city's four major parks and have spread out into the neighborhoods. It's KDK lead investigator Andy Sheehan shows us the city is about to take a bold step to get the deer population under control. Well, despite the opposition of animal rights groups, the Ganey administration and city council saying they are taking this bold step in order to save the city's major parks. In Riverview, Shenley, Frick, Highland and Emerald, the city says the deer have taken over, eating most all of the tree sprouts and the natural vegetation, and having depleted that food source, have been moving out, devouring gardens and colliding with cars. There's less food in the park, so they've moved into the neighborhoods and lost fear of humans, but they never lose their fear of dogs. Deer will attack off-leash dogs during the breeding season to defend their territory and their young. Mrs. Strasberger. Aye. Mrs. Warwick. Aye. After hearing complaints of residents and a coalition of park supporters, City Council approved the Ganey administration's plan for bow hunts in Frick and Riverview this year and the implementation of a citywide deer management plan next year and for years to come. This over the objections of the Humane Society of the United States, which sent this letter urging the city to explore other options. But supporters say culling the deer is the only way to save the parks. It's clear that the only effective and cost-efficient deer management plan for parks and hence for cities includes huntings. This weekend, the U.S. Department of Agriculture is expected to test and approve some 30 archers out of a pool of more than 100. Proponents say accidents involving bow hunters are few and far between and that the deer can be safely called in the city parks. The city wouldn't be reinventing the wheel. There's been a controlled archery hunt in all nine of the county parks for dec some, in some parks for decades. It has a very safe track record and it's done a wonderful job of helping to reduce deer populations in the county of Allegheny. And I give credit to this mayor's office and this city council for tackling an issue that obviously has some controversy behind it, but can't go on any longer without a resolution. And supporters say that this pilot program is only a first step to usher in a citywide deer management program that will need to cull deer for years to come. Reporting at City Hall, Andy Sheehan, KDK News.